Hi there, it's me, GamerTire. I'll be recapping Bee and Puppy Cat. This video is sponsored by my merch store, my PayPal donations, I mean my, I mean my Patreon page, my PayPal donations, my gifting site Throne, and my partnership of W Energy Drinks. More about them later. Episode 11, Puppy Cat is reading Bee's diary. Bee removes Puppy Cat's blanket and screaming, running away to one of her friend's house of, of Cass. Asking for help to fix Puppy Cat. They return to Bee's house to find Puppy Cat a noodle. Cat's looking at all of the Bee's cool stuff, but she can't help bu Puppy Cat. Not even her doctor. Later, Puppy Cat returns to normal. Then Puppy Cat eats off the floor again, and it happened again. And Bee realizes that it's eating off the floor. They need to eat off of, of a plate from now on. And then Bee and Puppy Cat take temp jobs with, with, with snails. Puppy Cat becomes huge, and B must turn him back to normal. B cleans up a lot of the trash using parts to build something to help him, but it's not working. Puppy Cat is stress eating, and according to the alien snails, he eat he eats and he he ate an old sock. Puppy Cat tells B the truth that he knew of about about the hand things that that were after him. That they're after him, and B report responded with, "You're you're an ugly crier, puppy cat." Returns home. Episode twelve. B blows up balloons in a clown world. S soon, B and puppy cat return and in end of the uh, of end up in the room of the guy who fixed her bike. She wanted to invite him to the clown world. Later, she, later he remembered a moment he had with B. Then later that day. B shows up to his house to bring him flowers. He sneezes. Then they take they take take. Then they get taken to temp space. They get temp bot to take her her back to the clown world. The three go exploring the fun house. The guy has fun, and then they return home. And he keeps, and he helps take care of Puppy Cat. They both fall asleep on the couch. The next morning, Puppy Cat is feeling better. Because he was actually, apparently he was sick. Episode 13. B sleeps on her friend's bed while she writes on the on, on the laptop. She awakens when a family, a family rumble breaks out. Then B and her friend have a pup, her party at an old job. And her old boss is hiding in the bathroom. They break in. Luckily he wasn't using it. They they all give him gifts. B's old boss takes a day off to go off to the off the island to a day spa and his friend is going to run the cafe the guy who's in charge of the cafe goes fishing and ends up get ends up getting his boat wrecked by a giant fish later he awakens to find what looks like a mermaid who can't who can't talk she doesn't look human but she has human features B and Puppy Cat are sweeping on the floor of the cafe Puppy Cat has to go to the bathroom and runs into the fish woman. B and Puppy Cat leave and, and, and says to the guy that she's that show that she's show the friend around town, not keep her in, in a in a bathroom. Puppy Cat has to go to the ba go bad. B gets a temp job at the toilet planet. Puppy Cat has to go bad, as it seems like this planet was right next right to the donut sh planet planet. Puppy Cat poops and the toilet planet gets clean. And he said he'd report them to Temp Space for pooping in on his planet. Episode 14. The aliens that are trying to capture Puppy Cat, one of them has been stuck for three days. The kid and and his classmates are going to the beach. The next day, they the kid returns home from school to find that the vines are growing all over the building. Affecting the pipes. B takes the kid to to the to bed. Puppy Cat eats the kid's dog's food. And Puppy Cat removed the vines and sends them to a cave in the beach. It's the same beach that the kid and his class was going to to B and Puppy Cat go to the temp space because Puppy Cat sent sent a breakup note signed from B's phone. Tim bot set 
Spinbot sad, but she sends them both to on an assignment. There's a quag. It's actually the creature that's after Puppy Cat that had his hand stuck that's causing the issue. The hands get attacked attacked by the alien weapon on the planet B and Puppy Cat show up at in the in the cave in the cave where the kids and our classmates were are trapped and the hands try to break through to pimp temp from temp space was about to use puppy cat and mouth laser. But they use mouth laser and it in the and that saves them all. Episode fifteen. Me and Puppy Cat work at a temp assignment with a giant cat head and it looks like they got a work work ban and it looks like their old friend from the donut planet comes breaking a giant hole in B's wall. B and, and me and the guy leave to get supplies to fix to help clean up help help fix fix the hole. B and B B and goes out to help clean dishes in the cat cafe. But the big guy keeps breaking dishes. Then they they get energy drinks for Cass. Then they head back to B's house after putting the kid to sleep. Puppy Cat fakes being, fakes being B, and takes the rest test to get back t- into sleep space. Working B makes the kid break breakfast. Now a word from our sponsors, my merch store. I offer shirts. Mugs, hoodies, phone cases, and more. My Patreon page, Emma Tartoons, support monthly starting as well as one dollar a month. A month I get a dollar fifty eight every three months per one dollar supporting me. You get my weekly work schedule posted every Friday, my animated sneak peek video of my upcoming anime video for forty dollars a month. You get merch delivered every three months, one item every three months, four items altogether. My PayPal donations send as much or as little as you'd like. Send me gifts with with the website Throne. I have many items on my wish list. If an item isn't on there you think I might like, say a comic book collection on eBay, I'll I'll add it. Thanks now for my partnership with W Energy Drinks. Get ten percent off your order with my code. Their their energy drinks are zero sugar without the crash. I get commission sales whenever you buy using my code. Thanks. Now back to the video. Episode sixteen. The alien globs that were off after the creature and they force him to they go after the creature well, the giant creature and they force him to take it take them to get puppy cat B's friend who went to cooking school is returned home but the classmate wants to follow him and be his friend B be his friend B and puppy cat are under the ocean. Then they return home to find the ha- the hands are 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 puppy cat pulled a wire, and the sleeping woman awakens. So he's 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 under the water and he's like in the spaceship. I think it's a spaceship or something. And when he pulls this wire, the, the sleeping woman of that little kid awakens. And puppy cat sits in his ship and the and B wants to help out their friend. The monster gets closer and closer to the island. The kid is scared, racing home to find his mother awaken. So he hugs so she hugs him. Everything goes crazy as giant wind blows and B manages to separate one of the arms. Unfortunately the rest stop her ripping her apart and B and Puppy Cat says we launched his ship. Unfortunately, part of the town was under it. B is washed up on shore, and Puppy Cat knows the the kid's mom has her name. Knows the kid's mom. Her name is Violet. On the ship, Puppy Cat repairs B, and and the giant. Then Puppy Cat blasts off, off Earth into space. Thanks for watching. Puppy Cat and all those other ones blast off the space. That's how it ends. Please subscribe for more recaps and more awesome videos. Help me reach 1,000 subscribers. Thanks. Also, support the channel by clicking on the links below. Bye for now. See you all next video. Bye.